whatever goals that you may have, whatever dreams that you may have, you will go through struggles. You will go through obstacles. You will fight and fight and fight. But you will not overcome those obstacles or get over those obstacles if you never realize and look at yourself and tell yourself that there is something wrong with yourself and you need to get better. And people also need to realize that whatever goals they have, it's now or never. And once you realize that, it will push you to new heights. What's up guys, your boy Alex back at it again with another Motivational Monday. And today's topic we're going to be talking about now or never. In the previous clips, you saw me, you know, at 266 pounds with no ambition, no drive, no goals, always drinking soda about four times a day, always doing this and always doing that, you know, eating bad almost every single day, you know, just working basically to feed myself all the time. No, no gym in my life, no you know, motivation, just always playing video games, always doing, you know, nothing productive. Now, for those of you who know, don't know, do not know, I don't drink soda. I used to be addicted to soda. I used to drink four soda cans probably a day. And now I don't drink any at all. Yes, I do drink Powerade. Yes, I sometimes do drink tea. Yes, I sometimes do drink Monsters, the sugar-free uh, zero calorie one, if that makes any difference. <laughs> I do drink, um, other stuff like milk and all that stuff, but I do not drink soda. Why? Because it was a, it was an addiction. It was a it was an addiction that I had, and to me, it felt like a drug, and that I needed it. And it wasn't a turning point. It was a turning point in my life where I was at Walmart, and I was wearing a gray shirt and, and blue jeans and black Vans. I saw myself in the mirror, and I was so overweight. I, I just started crying in the mirror. Imagine a 266 pound guy crying in the mirror in a public Walmart restroom, and I was just crying. I wasn't crying my eyes out, but I was just crying and tears came down my eyes. And you know, honestly, I was bullied. I mean, I wasn't bullied like in a way where, you know, people would beat me up, but I was bullied with words. And you know, I forgive the people who bullied me. I knew, I knew, I know that they were joking, but they didn't realize those jokes actually hurt me. You know, being called, you know, overweight, being called fat was honestly, it hurt me. I would sometimes cry, you know, and it was a big thing in my life and you know, it was honestly just hurtful. And after that day, I realized that, you know what? It's now or never. If I don't start losing weight right now, I will never start losing weight. And that's what you gotta, that's what I'm bringing to this video today. I'm making you realize that whatever dreams you have, whatever goals you have, whatever it is that you wanna do, you cannot take a break right now. You cannot, you know, say, okay, I'll do it next year because you don't know where you will be next year. You don't know if you'll have the same opportunity that you have right now next year. You don't know if you'll be in the same place, in the same situation, the same, you know, condition, the same, um, physical condition this and that whatever goals that you have you must do them right now you don't realize that you it that it's important to make it a now or never priority you have to chase your dreams right now you have to you know do whatever it is that you want to accomplish right now you have to go after it because what if it's too late because what if you can never get that opportunity again? What if you, you know, you mess up and you're gonna tell yourself, oh, what if? You can't live your life in what ifs. That's why whatever dreams I have, I'm chasing them right now. This YouTube dream, I'm chasing it right now. Why? Because what if I can't, you know, be this fitness person later on? What if I can't, you know, buy my mom something that I want to, always wanted to buy her later on because I didn't start right now or because, you know, I don't have any support behind me, you know, just little support, but I don't have the major support that, you know, most people want. No, that's not gonna stop me. I'm gonna keep working harder, like I said in my previous video. I'm gonna keep, you know, grinding. I'm gonna keep doing this. That. Why? Because it's now or never. You have to have that part. You gotta make everything, you know, all your goals, all your, you know, whatever is it, whatever it is that you want to do. You have to make them now or never priorities. You have to act like, no, this is important. The gym is more important than this. You know, I gotta go, you know, do that video because it's more important. I gotta go, you know finish that task that I gotta do for school or finish that task what it is for work or finish that task, you know, this and that because it's a now or never dream that you have. 
and now and ever dreams are impossible dreams are impossible dreams that can you can make impossible by just chasing them so please guys please realize that it's now or never so please I'm begging you chase your dreams chase whatever it is that you want to do there will be negativity and there will be very little support only from your loved ones and even your loved ones won't even support you sometimes but you have to chase your dreams because you have to find a why to push yourself. Whatever it is that's inside you that you can unlock from your in, inside yourself, you have to bring it out to put to you know to bring it to that 120%. And you gotta give more than what you can actually give. You gotta go that extra mile. You gotta go that extra task. You gotta go that extra you know goal. Stop being satisfied. Because honestly, it's now or never. Thank you guys for tuning into my video. If you haven't subscribed yet, please do. I would really uh, much appreciate your support. And I hope you like this video, guys. And thank you for tuning in. And I hope you see me in the next video. Tuesday, I will be dropping a legs workout video. And sometimes this week, I will be bringing a comedy skit. Thank you, guys.